Welcome, welcome, guys. Thank you, guys. Hey, Steve Butcher and Yomiko in the building. In the building. So I think, I think New Zealand and California have a lot of similarities. You know, like New Zealand, I when I think of New Zealand, I think of one of the most beautiful places in the world. You got the beaches, you got the coast, you got the outdoors. Uh, what does New Zealand not have that California does have? Because it seems like good, I would want to live here. Good fucking weather, bro. Yeah. <laughs> New, Zealand, New Zealand is like tropical, you know what I mean? So it's like four seasons in one day. How do you explain the absolute density of amazing tattooers from New Zealand? I mean, I think it's like because we're such a small country, you got to kind of push to stand out, you know what I mean? And like you got to kind of work hard to be noticed on a worldwide level, you know what I mean? So everyone's just kind of hustling, trying to get to that next thing, but the, everyone's super creative, like... They'll, they'll do heaps of campaigns, but everything's to do with artwork or design this or, you know, like it's just really art driven. Yeah, it trips me out because like a lot of the artists that I find for shirts happen to be from New Zealand. And I like trip out on that because it's not the biggest place. You but know? I mean, that's just the drive of a, of a Kiwi, man. We just got to try and be better than everyone else. Got to try and get noticed. Yo, Miko, let me hear a little bit about, uh, about your childhood, your upbringing. I mean, Venezuela, that's oh. I've never been there. You have to come. Yeah, man. The Venezuela there for sure is, is, for me, is one of the most beautiful countries in the world. It's not because of my country. It's because good weather, good people, beach, you no know, sunshine all the time. But in this moment, the situation is so bad. We don't have any dangerous animals. But we have dangerous people. Dangerous yeah. politics, dangerous. <laughs> no, I'm curious because I don't trust the press. You know, you that, never... Yeah, everyone's yeah. just looking no, at like clickbait, but it is. I went it's, there, it's rough down there. I went there I still, two years ago. To me. With, oh, last year. To me. He's, I went he, to his family's place and everything. And yeah. Man, that place is no joke. Yeah. yeah. No joke. It is dangerous as hell, bro. We yeah. had bodyguards around us 24-7. I had, I had two dudes <laughs> wow. sleeping outside of my room with guns. Sleeping outside my room every yeah. single night. That's for uh, Emilio's convention. Yeah, we want Emilio. It's but I mean, like, he, he organizes all this protection for us and stuff. But like, and, and you think it might be like overboard or overkill, but he's like, no, bro, you and like, you can't use your credit card there. Yeah, because yeah. their what machines, happens? their machines are wired to fucking take your take your information and then you're done. But the other side is a beautiful country, man. We have still come with us to the beach, to the island. We take good vacation. Other people so friendly, man. The people love. The people love to see the tattoo industry. You know, it's it's really friendly. I hear people. good things about the convention. You know, also we have a really good artist, man. How nice. do you get uh, supplies then in Venezuela? We have now, uh, for example, Emilio. Everybody now, Emilio here is is one of the guys. To for me, is one of my good friends, and also I start to working with him in 2008. Oh, so you've known Emilio for a long time? For a long time. Us too. He's, he's helped us out a lot. For a long time. For a long time. This guy, uh, honest, without Emilio, the tattoo industry in Venezuela probably no, sh no would be what it is really? now. Okay. Yeah, yeah, because... Shout out to Emilio. Yeah, man. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, he's because, such a good dude, too. Yeah, also, the, the biggest tattoo convention, he made the tattoo convention. Mm -hmm. He always tried to make good relations with the brands, with the company, to bring needles, to bring ink, to bring everything. He's the uh, only... It's pop only only place that the people have to find good in good machine and everything. That that's what I say. Emilio has been a really really important guy in the tattoo industry in Venezuela. Yeah. Emilio, bro, I've yeah. never seen so many people in a damn tattoo. They convention. knew who you were. They bro, they knew who lines. everyone was. Yeah, man. Everyone. I had we had lines from our booth. Yeah. I'm not even kidding you. Like our booth was upstairs. There was lines to take photos with us from the edge out down the stairs and out and around. Yeah. To go to the bathroom. And if we go to the bathroom, we run down, all the people from the line are like, oh, oh, <laughs> trying to take photos. And it's like, whoa, no, like. Uh, like just come. somebody who wants to get tattooed from you guys, like, what's the best way that you like to be approached? And like, does, does your DMs go crazy to where it's impossible to get into hey, you? It's kind of like being in a bar and somebody no, asking you to bro, tattoo. I, I get ones like, how, how, much, how much for a tat, bro? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You're, you're, and you're, I'm you're, like, I think just, it's dependent. I'm like, you know? man, I need a little bit more information. We need some images. We need the size, placement. What exactly. do you want? Me and my girl go through the DMs and then filter through them for my manager. Dude, love to get a tattoo from you. Love your work. I really want you to do this. This is what I want. This is where I want it. Uh, even if they have a budget, like whatever. If they send everything in one email, it's like this customer's from also, heaven. Yeah. Like, thank God. What up? I want to let everyone know, thanks to our Solon TV sponsors. Without you guys, we couldn't make this happen. Also want to let everyone know that we've been, we got a, a, a subscription going on. So sign up to solonclothing.com's email blast. Hey, but honestly, thank you so much, guys. Thank, thank you for, you for coming out. 
this was this is a really special one for us. We're excited Thank to have you. you guys. All right, guys, under the skin, Solon TV. You can hear us on uh, SoundCloud you. and Spotify and iTunes, and and of course, uh, go to the YouTube channel, subscribe to Solon TV. Uh, over a thousand videos for free. My partner, Color Crimes, Ryan Smith. I'm Jeremy Hanna, Instagram Uncle Jeremy. Thank you so much, guys. Let's do it again soon. All right. It sounds good.